I understand you have somewhere between a 10 and 20 car collection. Um, what does it entail? It's in there somewhere. <laughs> um, well, for the first time, they're all in one spot because, as I said, I moved home to Scotland. Um, so I brought um, my, my, the cars that I had in, in the US back to, to the UK as well. Um, so it's, you know, it, it might, the main sort of thing, it's, it's um, Ferraris and Porsches are my main sort of um, loves, I guess. Um, some, race, some of my old racing cars in there, pace cars from Indianapolis, a 65 pace car from the year Jimmy won at Indy. I mean, I could go on endlessly. I could, can, yeah, each day, I could buy a different car almost every day. I just, I've got an, an endless fascination with cars and... Uh, you have a special garage for it? Yeah, yeah, but it's unfortunately full now. So it's gonna be one out, one in. What would be the first edition? And what's the uh, favorite of what you have? Well, uh, the problem is the, the cars right now, the values is, is, are just going crazy. Um, absolutely insane. So um, most of the things, that I'm looking at I should have bought years ago and I'm not prepared to buy the top of the market so but there's a long long list of cars. So I, I understand you keep like all your memorabilia from your entire career at, at your house including like 60 of your helmets. Uh, why? Well just as we're sitting here talking about you know different memories little things in that room remind me of, of, of memories there's there's um, there's an invitation to one of the parties that Greg threw. Um, there's a, there'll be a, you know, there's a picture in my office of Dan, Tony, Brian, and myself. Um, you know, there's something that, that Scott Dixon gave me as a gift, or just little things like that. Um, right through my career, from day from day one, I've I've, I've kept little things just to kind of jog my memory and remind me of these fun things. I've got, you know, helmets of, of other drivers that, um, that I admire or friends of mine. Some of my heroes I've got that managed to find some of their helmets, you know, just stuff like that. It's, um, and I know you have an entire room devoted to Jim Clark at the house. Your mom has a different name for it, though. She says you're a hoarder. Uh, yeah, yeah, at least I think that's what she said. <laughs> yeah, the, a lot of people have been sending me these, uh, these reality TV shows on hoarders is, you know, is this shoe. But oh, yeah. It's very organized. It's not all just laying. Well, right now it's kind of laying around because I just had two containers arrive from America mm -hmm. with all my, with cars and different stuff. But it's, it's very organized.